Welcome to Isla Mujeres, a small island located off the coast of Cancun, Mexico. With its stunning beaches, crystal clear waters and vibrant culture, Isla Mujeres is the perfect destination for a relaxing getaway. Join us as we take you on a two-day journey of exploring this beautiful island. But before we get to Isla Mujeres, how would you reach this island from Cancun? We're going to Isla Mujeres and you can do that with a catamaran tour arranged here from Cancun. But instead we're going to stay overnight, arrange a bit more when we're there. And we took the ferry for 540 pesos plus 21 pesos per person for a round trip. 21.63. 21.63, but I say the prices here, but the prices increased so fast here. Uh, five years ago it was like 300 and we read online like 30 US dollars for someone who paid it last year. So prices increase rapidly. So check them before you go. And you can take them from the hotel zone nowadays as well, which is pretty convenient because then you can just arrive here by bus every hour. And now let's enjoy the island. Once you arrive, you could rent one of the many golf buggies or a scooter and explore the southern part of the island with the Maya ruins. We didn't do this, instead we decided to enjoy our time at Playa del Norte, a beautiful beach area where we tried to find some sea life while snorkeling. The first area wasn't that successful for us. But what about the second area around the beach? So yeah, we just came back from the other side of Playa del Norte and yeah, that one has uh, some good, uh, well, good, good. It has some fishes to see as well. It's a good place to explore. It's shallow, it's undeep, it's not a lot of waves and stuff. And it's free. So even without a snorkeling tour here on Isla Mujeres, you can still see a little bit of sea life as well. Playa del Norte is a beautiful beach. You won't find anything like this at Cancun. Definitely not at this time of the year. Whilst Cancun has all the seaweed at this time of the year, Playa del Norte is free from this all. Near Playa del Norte you also find the main shopping streets with the main restaurants. The next day it was time to find a snorkeling tour. But did we find something affordable? We just went around to different places to compare the snorkel prices for the different tours offered here. When we got arrived here yesterday it was 85 US dollars per person to do this tour and in the end, after negotiating, asking around in the hotel as well, we went down to 600 pesos per person, including lunch. So I'm excited to go and see how the marine life looks here. The snorkeling tour will take you around three areas. The first stop is the lighthouse. We already saw some small parrotfish before even jumping into the water next to the boat. Here you will jump into the water and the current will take you slowly back to the lighthouse. Some of the things we saw were some big barracudas. The current is pretty strong and there's no way you will be able to swim against it. The second stop is Musa, an underwater museum. Sculptures have been placed at the bottom of the ocean to motivate coral and other marine life to grow against those sculptures and in this way restore the underwater world. It is difficult to see it clearly from the surface, but if you would do scuba diving in this area, or if you can do some free diving, the sculptures will get clearly visible. After this second stop, it is time for a lunch break. Some grilled fish at the beach location. Then on the way back, there's a last opportunity to jump down and do some snorkeling. Only at this place, there isn't that much to see anymore. But all in all, what did we think of the snorkeling tour? What did you think of the snorkel thing, baby? Uh, I think... For 600, it was too 600 pesos is not that much indeed. For 600, it is indeed. I would say indeed, I agree. Worth, worth doing it. It's not that impressive underneath. But for the fact they also have a lunch included with a mackerel, it was quite nicely prepared. I think uh, it's worth doing it. It's a nice four hours activity. And then yeah, the snorkeling bit. Not that impressive underneath, but if you can get it for 600, just do it. The only bit that left us to do before heading back with the ferry to Cancun was enjoy the beautiful sunset from Playa del Norte. 
a final moment to relax on this very too easy reach island from Cancun. Something that's definitely worth exploring a bit longer instead of doing a quick one day catamaran tour. For now, there are still a lot of beautiful adventures waiting for us in Mexico.